So let's talk about something else that, that is highlighted in your submission. You talk about something called the patronage guarantee, which troubles mm. you. Tell us what it is and tell us why you don't like it. So the patronage guarantee is a mechanism within the contracting to the concessionaire Bombella, whereby if they don't meet um, their ridership figures uh, and they don't have the numbers that that they need to to obviously keep their concern uh, profitable, um, the South Teng government is going to subsidise that shortfall. Now, since 2012, that subsidy has uh, accrued to around 12.5 billion rand. Now, if you were to take that 12.5 billion rand and put it into other transport mobility for the masses. Um, buses uh, make cycle lanes available, give people bicycles, um, you know, encourage those types of non-motorized transport through better infrastructure development. Consider that many more people will then have uh, access to proper transport and they'll be able to travel a lot easier. Uh, the patronage guarantee is a fail-safe. It's a stopgap in, in, intended to protect the, con- uh, the concessionaire and um, it's coming from taxpayer money and we think that that money needs yes. to be spent uh, in a better way. So one of the things, Leighton Beer, that might come up when you propose uh, an extension of a bus mass transit system is people would say, well, let's look at where it's been tried and evaluate whether it's worked. The mm. assessment of the rear via in terms of its carrying uh, load, uh, the, the number of people who actually ride on it, I'm not talking about its capacity, people would say it, it's not exactly been a, a resounding success. Why do you think more of the same would work better? We think that if those services were extended to areas where more people are are using them and people need them and they were going to different areas that people needed to go to, there would be a bigger uptake of them. Um, if you're going to extend the car train because you believe people are going to ride on the car train, our view is, well, extend that through bus services. There's no need to lay tracks and to buy expensive property uh, and to buy, buy train carriages at uh, enormous amounts of money. Um, use the existing infrastructure, improve the infrastructure at a smaller cost cost, use buses to transport those people, and there will be a bigger uptake. I, I think the point that we're making, John, is that um, you're looking at, you know, at a thing like Ria Via um, uh, and, and, and the system that's in the Chwane area at the moment. Um, you know, there may not be as big an uptake, but there certainly isn't uh, an equally bigger uptake on car train. And if you were to improve those bus services, in our view, the, the, the people will come to it. News. Experts. Analysis. Where things stand. What you need to know. Drive home with John Pullman. On 702.